cannabis legalization activists in South Dakota recently filed two ballot initiatives to ban alcohol and tobacco in order to make state drug policies consistent. Bob Newland of Consistent South Dakota filed the two measures with the Secretary of State's office earlier this year. In May, Attorney General Marty Jackley released descriptions of the initiatives as required by law. Newland's first proposed measure would make the transfer of tobacco and tobacco paraphernalia illegal, while the second would ban the sale of beverages containing 1% or more of alcohol. Like the current penalties for cannabis possession, the measures would make the transfer of two ounces or less of tobacco or alcohol a class one misdemeanor, punishable by up to a year in prison and or a $2,000 fine. This would only be fair, according to Newland, who said, if you're going to put them in jail for a benign herb, they should be put in jail for alcohol and tobacco, the deadly drugs. The state should not profit from the legal transfer of two deadly drugs.